Well, this is a great start to Mother's Day. We are actually at the ER because it's Sunday and obviously doctor's offices are closed. But Liam has some stuff going on. It's hard to see right now because it's went down some, but he woke up this morning. His eyes were so puffy and he's had like green, I'm just gonna say like eye boogers because any other way of saying it sounds super gross. But Cody told me yesterday that he started having it and that um, his nose has been running and stuff, which isn't anything new, but he's never had it coming out of his eyes. I gave him some Claritin last night, but like I said, when he woke up this morning, his eyes were so puffy and it was all in his eyelashes and I had to like open his eyes. It was, it was bad. So we're not really sure if it's just allergies or if it's like he's sick. They just took his temperature and it's 99. So he may be sick. He's trying to escape from the room. He does not like being trapped in these rooms at the doctor's offices and stuff. Like he literally just tries to escape the whole time. Anyway, hopefully it's nothing major. Hopefully we're not here for very long because it's hard to keep him content in situations like this. So if we're in here for like hours, it's gonna be pretty miserable. I've given you snacks. I've given you juice. Why you wanna do this? I hope you guys are having a better Mother's Day than I am. Because he does not like this thing on his ankle at all. He is just so bothered right now. This kid is so irritable right now and I don't know why. He's been fine all morning. It's like he knows whenever he's being like contained and he cannot stand it. We got some Teddy Grahams and some PJ masks. Everything's gonna be fine. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it through this. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Mm -hmm. He got himself a popsicle, so now he's in a better mood. Is that yummy? Don't get it all over the sheet, baby. Get it all over the sheet. You gotta eat it. Oh my gosh. That was not fun. I have my AC on right now. Hopefully it's not too disturbing, but I can't, literally can't turn it off because it's so hot outside right now. <sighs> Liam did not do well in there at all. Like He usually doesn't like being um, in doctor's offices and stuff like what toddler does, but this was one of the worst, worst times. The doctor was trying to give, or not the doctor, but the nurse was trying to give him Tylenol <clears throat> and um, put some eye ointment in his eye and it was like the worst thing <laughs> ever. She was showing me how to put it in and everything like that. So basically, turn this down a little bit. They did tell, tell me that I need to give him something for allergies. So like Claritin, which is what um, he usually takes for allergies. So we're just sticking with that. And then they said Tylenol or ibuprofen. I'm probably gonna just give him ibuprofen because they were saying it would obviously help with the swelling of his eyes, whereas Tylenol wouldn't. So I'm gonna do the Motrin, the Claritin, and then like I said, they gave me these little, some kind of eye ointment. And so I have to do that twice a day for seven days. Hopefully he does better with it at home. I have to stop at Walmart. I have to get him some diapers. I ran out of coffee. I started today without coffee. Is this even Mother's Day? Is this even Mother's Day? I feel like it's gonna be like such a rough day. I'm trying to stay positive. It's fine, he can't help it. This is what I'm supposed to do as a mother. It's fine, but um, it's it's just gonna be a rough week. I think that's the reason why I'm just kinda like, oh, we had to go to the hospital today because Tuesday, I've told you guys this in the last vlog, but Tuesday is whenever he's supposed to get his evaluation for speech therapy. Thursday is when he's supposed to get his surgery, like get his tongue tie fixed, and today's Sunday. So probably not taking him to daycare tomorrow because he did, he does have a fever now. They said it was like 99, which I know isn't high, but I think he's about to spike a fever, which is what the doctor said because he hasn't had a, a fever this whole time and they said this is either kind of like a cold or like allergies and that him kind of like wiping his nose and then getting it up into his eye something like that that's what happened anyway I've probably been talking for a long long time we are gonna go ahead go to Walmart please fingers crossed fingers crossed that he's better in Walmart than he was in the hospital I made a pit stop at parties and I got to give Liam some fries because he already sounds like fat back there but we're headed to Walmart now get this over with tomato all over his shorts and I did not pack any more clothes he looks pitiful look at his face this is from the ointment though on his eyes oh my goodness I need to wipe his face off I ended up putting Liam's bracelet thing on myself because he couldn't stand it being on his ankle so maybe people in here will feel sorry for me they'll be like oh my gosh she she's sick she just came from the hospital she's doing the best she can because this is gonna be a crap show I can already feel it I can feel it right right Oh my goodness, guys. What What is my life right now? What is that? No, we can't go in yet. 
Um, okay. How do I get that off? Oh no, Liam. It's all in his seat. Oh my goodness. Oh, I didn't bring any shorts. Any... It's just a day. Let's not think about the fact that it's Mother's Day. Let's just think of it as any other day. So that way I don't get upset. It'll be fine. He'll be in the cart. He'll be sitting on his butt. Nobody will see it. It's fine. It's fine. It'll be fine. Lord help me. Okay, so it's pretty much a hard cut to like three hours later. I completely stopped vlogging earlier while we were out. I had a meltdown basically. Everything was going wrong. Today has been awful, awful, just completely awful. And I almost hate talking about it on the vlog because I feel like, you know, there are people that have bigger problems and it's like, oh boo hoo, you're upset because you're having a bad day on Mother's Day. Like, I don't know. I know most of you guys are supportive and amazing and wouldn't like leave comments like that to me about this but at the same time i kind of i feel silly even though really today has been awful and everything's gone wrong and i've been super overwhelmed just with life as it is and just today having a bad day just made it so much worse but liam's napping right now he's been asleep for like an hour and a half i don't know how long he's gonna nap he might nap longer because he's sick i don't know but I did want to unbox something for you guys and I'm hoping that it's gonna <laughs> put me in a better mood. I literally laid in my bed after I laid Liam down and I watched um, one of Kira from OK Baby slash K Baby's new video on K Baby. Anyway, it was like a 25 minute long video and I sat there and watched it and um, the whole entire thing. And <laughs> right after I was like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna finish vlogging today. But anyways. So, more than just moms reached out to me and they asked me if I would like for them to send me one of their seasonal subscription boxes and I was like, um, yes. So I had never heard of more than just moms, so I'm gonna read the email that they sent to me to you guys, or not the whole email, but like their description of what the box is about. So it is a seasonal subscription box and it says this box is designed to bring our favorite items for a mom who wants to look beautiful, feel relaxed, be on trend, all while adding a little something each time for your little one and then another email said it's a seasonal subscription box service for busy moms which is perfect for me so I really want to go ahead and open it and see what's in here the box itself so cute so cute and I figured it would be a perfect thing for me to open today on Mother's Day considering this is my first Mother's Day as a single mom so it literally I got this in the P.O. box like a week ago I think it was and I stuck it in my closet and I didn't I wasn't sure when I was going to unbox it and then it just occurred to me today that it would be the perfect day for that and I've never watched an un unboxing of this or anything like that so I really literally do not know what's in here so this is what it looks like it's got pretty pink paper and I don't know what these are but I'm gonna let you guys know oh okay I think it's telling me what's in here but I kind of like don't want to look at it so this card tells you on the back what's in it. I don't know if I said already, but this is the spring box. Okay. We're just gonna we're just gonna dive right in. Okay, so I'm gonna try to like let you guys, you know, open it with me. So when you open it, oh, ooh, this might be for what they put in here for your child. Might be for a smaller child, but this is. This will be perfect for Bexley, my sister's baby girl, if you guys do not know. So this must be the item for the child. This is so cute. Allison, you're probably gonna see this before you're watching this. It's a little bib. This is gonna go to Bexley, for sure. This is so cute. And look at the packaging now that I've gotten everything out of the way. Is that not so cute? That's so pretty. Okay, so the next thing I see, it looks like a tea. Good night, sweet dreams tea. Ooh, I need this because I've been having so much trouble falling asleep. Relaxing combination of herbs to ease you into a restful state of sleep also helps reduce nervousness and anxiety. Do not drink if pregnant or breastfeeding, noted. And it's in such cute packaging as well. I'm gonna try this literally tonight, tonight. I'm so excited about that. This one is, is this a tea also? Oh, she glows. 
Ooh, that sounds like something that I need. Bring out your inner beauty and let your skin shine with this combination of herbs high in antioxidants and vitamin C. A gentle liver cleanse will help illuminate toxins and balance hormones, leaving you feeling radiant. That's what I need in my life. Do not drink if pregnant. This one does not say breastfeeding. It just says do not drink if pregnant. So I'm assuming you can drink it if you're breastfeeding. The next thing that I see are some masks. So this one is Beauty Restore Hydrating Facial Sheet Mask. Restore, regenerate, and repair. I need that. Hydrating Facial Sheet Mask, All Nighter, Awaken, Replenish, and Refresh. I love masks. I actually have bought some face masks recently, but I have failed to use them. I buy them and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm gonna have a little pamper night and I'm gonna use these and then I never do it. So I need to do that. I need to get on that. Let me know if you guys want to see a video where I do like a, a pamper night. I've thought about that so many times in the past and I just haven't done it yet. So let me know if that's something that you guys would be interested in or if not, tell me if not, I don't, I don't mind. The angle might look slightly different because I did have to turn my camera off and back on because it likes to overheat whenever I film for too long at a time. But anyway, but the next thing that I did pick up right before it overheated was this eyeliner. It says smooth ride, supercharged eyeliner. I actually have not wore eyeliner in forever. It's blue. It's blue. A creamy waterproof eyeliner, supercharged with pure pigments. The soft and creamy formula glides on effortlessly, allowing enough time for blending, then sets to a long lasting finish that won't budge no matter what trouble you get into. Sassy. Okay. The next thing that I'm seeing in here is a facial moisturizer. There's two of them in here, so they're like little sample sizes. And there's also um, samples of the facial cleanser. I'm trying to talk faster now because I absolutely cannot stand whenever my camera overheats. So <laughs> I'm trying to like beat my camera and talk really fast. I've been wanting to use a different... Ooh. I don't even know how to explain how this smells. The moisturizer, it smells so good. I've been wanting to try, anyway, a new moisturizer. I'm sorry, I, I babble. This looks fancy, look at this packaging. I don't even know what this is, what is this? Roll on to palms of hands and breathe in gent or gently. Oh my goodness, and breathe in deeply, not gently, deeply, that's the opposite. Also great on wrist pressure points or as a mini massage. Focus on an intention and combine with affirmation to enhance chakra boost chakra right is that Whew, guys i can't do it today i cannot do it so it looks like it's just full of essential oils that's interesting it's a roller ball Ooh, look at this packaging you guys like how fancy is this how fancy oh my goodness guys okay the real question is how do we get the bottle out because i'm smelling it right now let's see what the card says about it really quick this is why my camera keeps overheating because i'm trying to read everything an alternative to perfume this is an all natural collection can be applied on neck temples we've already been over that so let's sniff it i'm trying to be fast now oh it's so cute i have a little rollerball thing for my essential oils but this one's so super tiny where did i say to roll it on my wrist Ooh. Ooh, that does smell kind of similar to like one of the like joy or something essential oils that i've smelled before i keep sniffing my wrist that is so cute love love this i'm gonna keep this in my purse this could be a perfume i'm gonna use this as my perfume until it runs out and the last thing that i'm seeing is what is this what, is this? what are these i'm confused <laughs> sniffed them I sniffed them guys because I'm confused. Oh, literary bookmarks. Okay, they're bookmarks. They're really pretty. I just weren't, wasn't sure what they were at first. And my camera's trying to overheat again. So I'm trying to show them to you guys. Super cute. So that is everything that came in the More Than Just Moms box. And I'm gonna show you guys really quick what it looks like with everything kind of propped up in it. A little overview, cause you know I did like a little Instagram story of it, of course. And it's so funny that they put this in there. It's almost like they knew what I needed in life because I've had such a bad day and this is supposed to make you happy. So I keep sniffing my wrist, hoping that it will like do its magic. But I really do like the way that this smells. So if you guys are interested in this box, I will leave all of their information down below. And of course I did ask them for a discount code for you guys. So if you use the code Courtney 60, you will get 60% off your first box. So if you guys are interested, definitely check them out. Like I said, all the information will be down below. 
Now I'm going to wait for Liam to wake up. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my time. And we have to go back to Walmart after he wakes up because I forgot some things. Of course, just the cherry on top of my life. Maybe he will feel better once he, you know, has his nap and everything and it'll be an easier shopping trip because it was not fun. It was not easy, I promise. I promise you guys I will get my crap together and these vlogs will be more positive. I'm trying to be positive. I've just been really, really overwhelmed, you guys. Like, I, I won't lie to you guys, I've been overwhelmed. I have days where I'm fine and then I just have days where everything comes crashing down on me pretty much and I'm just like, I just have days where I don't know if I can do it and then I have days where I'm confident and it just goes back and forth and so I just try to tell myself that tomorrow I may be super duper confident and everything will be fine and yes I have a butcher knife out because for some reason I thought I was going to need this to open that box and I didn't need a knife at all because so I was being extra it's fine. I do want you guys to know though that I appreciate every single one of you guys that do watch our videos and leave sweet comments because honestly those are some of my best days whenever I upload videos. I am so excited on upload days because I know that you guys are going to be so sweet and so awesome in the comments. It literally makes my day. I know that YouTubers say that all the time but I don't know why I'm out of breath. <laughs> it's so silly. But it literally, I, I'm not just like saying it just because it's something to say. I It literally makes me feel so much better. And sometimes I'm having a terrible day and then I read comments from you guys and it completely turns my day around. So thank you guys so much for leaving me so many comments. It makes me so happy. My child literally fell asleep for his nap at like one something. So I'd say it's time to wake him up. Are you awake in here already? How are your eye boogies? Oh, not too bad. Are you feeling okay? He's like, ooh, it's bright in here. It's so bright. I love you. I do. You wanna go to Walmart? We have to go back to Walmart. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'll let you play for just a minute. Then we gotta go, okay? He's like, shoot, let me wake up. I haven't gotten a good look at his eyes yet, but I don't think they're too bad right now. Like for him to have just woken up from a like four hour nap. <laughs> you wanna cut eyes? What are you doing? Okay. 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 Okay, one more. One more. This one tastes better, okay? Good job, baby. Good job. Now we gotta clean your eye boogies again. There you go, baby. Can we admire how stinking cute this little Nike outfit is on him? It's so cute. I mainly did this because I wanted to put him in these shorts because I just realized his car seat's still dirty and I didn't want to put him in his little uh, khaki shorts. Where are you going? Where are you going? You ready to go? Let's go. Let's go. Bye-bye. Look, you're gonna run to the door. Look at me. Can't get fast fast enough. He knows exactly what those keys mean. I gotta put shoes on you though first, Boogie. We're gonna try to somewhat clean your seat out first. These are those things I was talking about to keep from, from like going outside if he climbs out of his crib and stuff. Mm -hmm. Yep, you haven't figured those out, have you, buddy? Nope. <laughs> no. Nope. <laughs> He's like, but I will. Oh, there we go, there's his outfit. So handsome, I can't even stand it. Yes you are, you know you are. Okay, let's go. Let's go, bye bye. inside of Walmart because we literally were just like in and out of there and today it's been super crowded which I expected this morning because of people getting like last minute Mother's Day stuff but it's like six o'clock at night I don't understand why it was so crowded at six o'clock at night on Mother's Day but it was someone's calling me so hold the thought and now we're home because I was on the phone for longer than I expected. This vlog's probably all over the place, but I am gonna go ahead and end it here. Liam is, let me, wait, let me just show you what Liam's doing. I don't have my lights on, so it's not very bright in here, but he's got all my shoes out, walking around in my shoes. Why are you doing that? Can you say bye-bye? 
His face doesn't look that bad. He's crusty and stuff from all the junk, but his eyes aren't that puffy anymore, so that's good. Okay, show them. <laughs> Is that not the funniest thing ever? Oh, he needs some gray shoes, actually. You, you do say shoes? Shoes. Okay. He does know how to say shoes though. That is one of the words that he does know how to say. But anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I hope that all of you moms out there had a better Mother's Day than I did. It wasn't, it wasn't terrible. It just wasn't the best day ever. Anyway, I hope that you guys had a really good Mother's Day. If you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you liked what you saw, don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.